A Hamilton High School student is standing up to homophobia in a very colorful way. And as our Elizabeth Hall reports, his message of acceptance is spreading like wildfire. Hey guys, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Jared McCarthy. I'm a student at Westmount Secondary School. So yesterday I got into a bit of an argument with another student who was making some inappropriate comments about gay people. Um, and when I challenged him about it, he told me that if I was so supportive of gay people, why don't I go out and wear a rainbow shirt tomorrow? So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I decided to get a few of my friends in on it uh, to, you know, help me shut this kind of stuff out. And they said, you know, try to get as many people as you can. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, tomorrow, uh, Friday, March 24th, it, whether you're at West Mount or not, um, I invite you to uh, help out with the cause by wearing something rainbow, whether it's a t-shirt, a, a bandana, a bracelet, anything, you know, but 2017, you know, no need for this. Um, so, you know, take a photo, post it using the hashtag, not at my school, just spread the word. Thanks, guys. Sixteen-year-old Jared McCarthy asking people to wear rainbow colors has over 60,000 views on Facebook. And today, Westmount High was full of color. Everyone should have a place at Westmount. Everyone should feel accepted. No one should feel left out. We need to know that everyone feels safe in this school, and by doing this, I feel like people will be more open. I hope this just becomes a trend, you know? But for me, as someone who doesn't really know what it's like to be subjected to homophobia, um, I just kind of tried to put myself in someone else's shoes. And, and it means a lot. It's important to me because I've been a victim of uh, homophobia at this school. and It's really awesome to see someone standing up for us. I think it's absolutely amazing. It's him rallying people to wear rainbows and stand up against bullying is exactly what um, you know we encourage people to do. And it's not just here at West Mount High that Jared's rainbow statement has caught on. I was told last night that there's I was told last night that there's a couple other schools doing this, uh, one in York region and I believe the other two are in Mississauga. And elementary school students are taking part too. Just search hashtag not at my school on any social media and you'll find a number of GTHA kids wearing rainbow shirts. Putting an end to homophobia, one rainbow. is about supporting, uh, showing our support for the LGBTQ community. Uh, you know, we have some people in this school who are not in support and so we're, you know, banding together to show 
that it's not right and that we do support this community. So we started on Wednesday night and here we are today. So are you hoping to make it maybe an annual event or what's, what's the plan? That would be awesome, yeah. If we could uh, get this going every year, um, you know, continue growing it, uh, not just at Westmount but in other schools around the city. You can see behind me there's quite a few and more people still coming. Uh, it's still about five minutes before everyone's supposed to be here, so we'll see. Um, I know there's a couple other schools too in Mississauga, one in York, who are uh, doing a sort of rainbow day. And uh, I know Sherwood had an announcement about it today, so you know it's, it's spreading. It's, it's spreading.